And yeah, you can see the line behind me here waiting to get on Vortex. I'm told 1,500 people pass through this line every hour, hundreds of people turning out to get one final ride on the Vortex. And the park says it's been busy like this most weekends since they announced the ride would be shutting down at the end of the season. When Vortex opened in 1987, it was the tallest full circuit roller coaster in the world. It also featured the biggest drop at 138 feet. This video from Kings Island shows some of the final Vortex rides taken today. The coaster features six inversions, another first when it debuted 33 seasons ago. Kings Island says people have been flocking to Vortex these last few weekends to take one final ride on the coaster. We know it, Vortex has a special place in the hearts of our guests. Um, they've been coming out in droves since we made the announcement that Vortex was going to close today. Uh, and uh, it means a lot to everybody. While well, Kings Island says goodbye to Vortex, it is building a massive 300-foot giga coaster on the other side of Coney Mall. Orion will be the seventh giga coaster in the world and will also be the 10th fastest roller coaster when it opens next year. The park says roller coasters like the Vortex typically last around 25 to 30 years, and it says Vortex just reached the end of its service life. Some of these riders will be the last to make one more memory on the famous roller coaster. Reporting live in Kings Island, Josh Bazan, 9 on your side.